Hello, my name is Matt Chase. I'm the Executive Director of the National Association of Counties. And I want to talk to you today about a key federal issue, Waters of the U.S. It's a current regulation that's being proposed by EPA and the U.S. Corps of Engineers. And it's going to have a significant impact on the day-to-day -day operations of America's county government. Back in April of this year, after nearly a decade of discussions and different level of federal action, EPA and the Corps have come together to propose this regulation. In recent weeks, EPA has extended the deadline at our request and some of our coalition partners to October 20th of this year, 2014. So now is time to take action after nearly a decade of discussion. Now is the time for action. Why is this a big issue for county governments? Well, basically, under the EPA regulations, the federal oversight would be extended into our roadside ditches, into our stormwater responsibilities, and several other major issues. With counties owning 45% of the roads, this will be a huge issue for us, including on your day-to-day -day maintenance of your ditches, your culverts, and other infrastructure. What we are looking for is for county governments across the country and your coalition partners to submit comments. Up to this point, over 5,000 unique comments have been submitted to EPA on waters of the U.S. We need to make sure that these comments are overwhelmingly opposing this regulation and at a minimum asking for increased clarity, uh, clarity from EPA on some key definitions. If this goes through, county governments will face increased cost. We will have delayed projects and you'll also be open to citizen lawsuits and other lawsuits under this proposed regulation. So again, now is the time to take action. Not only do we need you to pass resolutions locally, but we need you to submit them to EPA through their official process. NACO's developed a really robust website at naco.org slash WOUS. On there, we have an analysis of the proposed regulations. We have sample comments that you can submit to EPA. We even have social media tweets and Facebook posts that you can use for the public and to raise awareness. But this is a serious issue. We need you to take action. I encourage you to go to the NACO Clearinghouse on Waters of the U.S. Take a look at our sample analysis. Use our draft comments and submit them to EPA. Get your coalition partners back home to submit comments as well, whether they're homeowners, businesses, farmers, and others. This is the time to act. Thank you again for your support, and please call us for any assistance.